All right, all right, all right. I'm here with our newest arrival. This is a 2024 Twin V 320 CC. And uh, just talk about an amazing offshore platform. This thing looks like a sport fisher. Shoot, she rides like a sport fisher. She's 32 feet, two inches long. She sports a 10 foot, four inch beam. Dry weights, 8,200 pounds. And she's got a 290 gallon fuel capacity. Just look at those lines. Boy, she's got some good looking lines. This one's got a pair of Mercury's new V10 400 horsepower engines on there. Big old four blade props. And she's got all the options. Nice gray color on the bottom. Matches Molly's vest. She got some nice underwater lights. Big 30 gallon live well here. She's got a pass through walkway on this side. And a little sandbar cooler here. That way you can put some Diet Cokes and some ice in there. And you don't got to get in and out of the water too much. She's got a nice fold down stern seat here. And then this just folds away if you're out fishing. Nice dive door. Got another live well here on the leaning post along with the sink. And then she's got some nice tackle storage here as well. And then we've got a pair of 35 gallon macerated fish boxes here. <clears throat> so you've got two 35 gallon macerated fish boxes nice rod storage you know tidewater boats are uh they get hit with the foam twice so they're filled with foam when they're in the mold and then when they pull them out they hit them again make sure everything's perfect let's see what we got here plenty of room for some extra batteries or or just storage or whatever put a trolling motor on here that's maybe where, maybe where you want to put your batteries She's got the LeBrock Billfish helm seats, best seats in the market. Folding bolsters, armrests, nice center armrest here. Or you could sit three wide. Big old Simrads, twin Simrads, built in phone charger, Mercury vessel view. She's got the Skyhook joystick, JL audio and speakers everywhere. Nice dry storage. It's got a motorized window vent, so you can just push the vent open or close button there and get some wind in your hair or lack of hair. Just depends. Nice push button switch panel, USB port with a lightning charger as well. Super nice, super nice. On your hard top towards the back, you'll notice that she's got a fresh water shower right here. So you just push the shower button and like I said, hair or no hair, it'll get you wet. Big LED light bar on the back with plenty of speakers everywhere. Rod holders are plenty. She's got another uh, six rod holders back here on the transom. And then they just keep them lined up. head is one of the nice portions of this boat you can see it's got a nice china bowl head with an overboard discharge and then she's got a little day cabin here so if the wife or the kids are tired or you're in some inclement weather they can get down in here and get out of that weather you're in the center lowest part of the boat it's a smooth ride there's your dive ladder holder mirror mirror on the wall what's the best boat of them all tide water tide water Battery switches. Your batteries are in here for your house and engine batteries. They go underneath here. And then they've got the folding uh, backrests here so you can just hit these switches 
and then she folds in and becomes part of the bolster. That way you don't got a headrest that you got to figure out where to stow. The seats, they made it to where you can open up these 55 gallon forward fish boxes here without having to remove the cushions. So that's a nice feature. Typically, you got to take the whole cushion off, get into your fish box, put the cushion back on. They thought about it. Cup holders are plenty, three on each side. And you've got your USB charger there for your media. And then I don't have batteries in this girl yet, but you can see she's got the table switch here. And this whole piece here is the table. So that comes all the way up and you can make it uh, even with your cushions. And then I've got this bow cushion here. So that way it just makes a bow filler and you can lounge out and have a good time. Or you can bring that table all the way up and then use it as it's made as, you know, a nice big table. You've got a big cooler here. On this nice uh, coffin box lounge seat. And same thing, it's got your triple armrest. I bet you this one has a cup holder in it. Let me see. I'm not usually a betting man. Oh, I would have won. Two cup holders. She's got the windshield wiper, forward spreader lights, speakers everywhere. Very nice windless locker here with some tow buttons. She's wired for a trolling motor already. And I mean, that's bigger than you think as far as like a casting platform. If you're trying to get up here and throw a cast net you can do it. It's a big surface. Super nice boat. Remember, she's got a 10 foot, four inch beam. So nice and wide. She's got that nice recessed bow rail. Goes all the way forward. Big giant hard top. This one's got some uh, carbon fiber telescoping outriggers already. Super nice. This is a yacht certified vessel and your battery charger, you plug her in right under. Let's see how this door folds up and looks go so super nice boat 2024 tidewater 320 this is their cc adventure live wells are plenty rod storage are plenty nice door uh, dive door all the electronics you need and you know the deal we just got to get you out of your old boat and into this new one <clears throat> so i take trades We've got financing. Oh, yeah, she's got a 19-gallon fresh water tank. I forgot about that. Both the fresh water and uh, your uh, black water, your toilet water, it's got a 19-gallon tank on it. So plenty of fresh water. Plenty of room to hold your poopy. Plenty of horsepower with the 400 V10 Mercury's. And she looks amazing. You know the deal, Jared sells boats. Come see me, come see me. I've got financing, insurance, take trades. Molly will be ready to lick your face off.